The masquerade is over, but it ain't over. Hmm. The masquerade is over, but it's not over. You just learned something new, so what you gonna do about it? You learned something new about you. About a membrane being torn through. A violation of your of your code. You know what I'm saying? A violation of a, a violation of your code. What you represent. How you represent you and how you move out here in this matrix. Something going on this weekend. But I, I know Saturdays are somebody's favorite day. Somebody could have been born on a Saturday. It's a rebirth that's happening this weekend, God darn it. Yeah, you're not going to be able to question it neither. You're going to know this is a divine movie. Somebody feel like you were L7, like you soft as charming, like you don't hold no weight. They've been judging you for such a long time. It's something when I'm hearing like you being defensive, being defensive of you, being defensive of your time too. You defensive now. You just not just, you know, keeping people at a distance. Not letting anybody assess you. <laughs> it's a meeting in the ladies' room. <laughs> It's a meeting in the ladies' room, and they all about to be crying. They all about to be crying. Pay attention to the people that's coming in and out of your life. It's a divine movement taking place. Somebody about to be crying. They coming in as soft, but they soft-spoken. Something wrong with somebody's septic tank. It's backed up, is what I heard. They soft-spoken, but they full of shit. This person, um... Somebody a hypochondriac. It could be you. This person has been masquerading like they come in divine energy. Like they wasn't coming to fuck up any divine plans or lead you down a shit brick road and have you repeating any karmic lessons. But this person found out something about somebody. You found out something about somebody. They found out something about somebody. Somebody always repeating a karmic lesson. They like it that way. If this person don't have drama in their life, they confused. They confused. They confused. They confused. Somebody could be throwing in a towel and then I hear somebody's just about to step their foot in the door. It's, it's, it's kind of like higher learning, you know? They associate with somebody who has highly awakened gifts, whatever those gifts are, one of them mainly being intuition. They about to wrap it for them. They about to wrap it for them. No, 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 they wasn't wrong. They wasn't wrong. You just was drawn to the dark side is what I'm hearing. Oh, let's get it together then. Somebody about to check your hand for you. What's good? You already are aware of it though. They've been talking. It's a meeting in the ladies' room. I'll be back real soon. Everybody about to pause. Because you being delivered from from evil. You've been delivered from your enemies. But your enemies are about to be delivered into the hands of the beast. And the beast, I'm hearing, is being represented as a divine presence. Somebody is kind of going to show some mercy, but not really. Because somebody feels like they're going to be up in, in the domains, all in the personal realm of being, all off of your Face too close, breath all hot and shit, talking shit is what I'm hearing. Yelling to the top of their lungs, but they full of shit, man. It's a whole, it's a whole skit that they putting on, but only they know the punchline and they wrote this shit. Shit, it's some grade A bullshit, but it's a meeting in the bathroom. It's a meeting in the bathroom today, somebody... Is in the house tonight. Stand up. <laughs> Standing up.
Okay, but stand up, Hoagie. Mmm. Let's see. What the G's want you to know? Y'all know I'm just coming to get you hip to what you hip to, what hip you on to what may be hidden. I want to welcome all of my new subscribers, those who've been rocking with me out the gate, those who just subscribed, and some of you who just fallen through it was good. If this message resonates with you, take what resonates and leave the rest. Don't try to make it fit just because it sounds good. If somebody just swear that you 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 green in the gills. They trying to get on your nerves. They trying to make you sick. You hear me? There, they trying to get on your nerves. They trying to make you sick. You make me sick. Shut up. Type of energy. But they they poking and making fun of you at per on purpose. There is a purpose. There is a principle. It's something that they trying to regurgitate. <laughs> you hear me? Something that they trying to regurgitate. It's from the past, and you didn't you didn't climb up off of that horse already. Somebody took the bull by the horns and slammed him in the dirt. The bull said they ain't want to play no more. All right, you win. Somebody, <laughs> damn. The bull said somebody has stomped down. Stomp? Mm -mm. I'm hearing Kirk Franklin stomp, though. Quit eating that KFC chicken. Ugh, y'all. Come on now, look at it. Anywho, whoever it is tall, dark, and sexier than a motherfucker is, they was stuck on stupid and locked down on dumb. But you was your highly awakened self. Yeah, you intuitive as hell. That's one of your gifts. It's been like that for a long time is what I'm hearing. But you've been plagued with these karmic cycles that don't belong to you being empathetic and having these empathetic views and seeing down the line, you know, and what is to come. If people don't make these moves, you don't already try to give them, you know, the recipe, not for disaster, you know, not for disaster, but for them to yield is what I'm hearing. Somebody yeasty. Bold. Some woman was rubbing this man's hair up out of his head. He been rubbing his hair up out of his head, too. But somebody yeasty. It's unbelievable. But somebody going bold. I just heard karma bites. Veered up off the destined path for a minute there, bro. Mm-mm-mm. This is what's about to shock your ass back on there. It's like, you know, regurgitation. It's kind of like resuscitating. You know, it, 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 this was a point of somebody trying to plaster somebody on the wall. Somebody might be trying to, you know, pass some holes to on the walls because somebody was pissed to the highest point of positivity for whatever reason I'm here. It's a meeting in the bathroom and they punched the wall. Engagements. Hold up. Wait a minute. Pimping, what's good? Pimping, what's good? That's what I'm hearing. Fire, fire, fire. It's supposed to be a congratulations in order. But this this ace of cups is reversed. It's reversed. It's reversed because it's not right. It's not the turn of events that somebody was hoping for. Somebody went left. They went left field. Somebody went out into the community is what I'm hearing. And they've been asking a whole bunch of questions. Virgo. Been asking a whole bunch of questions. But they haven't done a thorough investigation, so they're keeping their hands to themselves. They haven't done a thorough investigation. They just waiting though. They ain't congratulated shit yet. Because somebody is guilty, but this Virgo ain't found out yet. This Virgo ain't found out yet, or it could be about this Virgo. Y'all take it where it resonates. But it's a generational curse. And we rebuke and break those. I break all generational curses of pride, lust, perversion, rebellion, witchcraft, evil eye, poverty, idolatry, rejection, fear, confusion, addiction, death, destruction. In the name of our Heavenly Creator, Father, and our Brother Jesus, that is going to be the turn of events because somebody was attracted to the to the darkness that was within. 
somebody getting married, right? But whoever this Virgo is, they're like, uh uh uh. At first, you know, I thought she was going to be a life mate. Because, you know, married a family too, you know? But no. What I was attracted to, I've grown up out of. Somebody has evolved. They have went through a spiritual awakening. And there's something with this tall, dark, and handsome that they don't want to, they don't want this tall, dark, and handsome to repeat a cycle in their life. It's a major event, of course. Marriage is, but it's a karmic cycle. It's a generational curse. Fire, fire, fire. Somebody, I'm, I heard Pyru too. Pyru, that's what I heard. Colors. Somebody was watching colors. Somebody been tight lipped though. Somebody been tight lipped. When it comes to this great love opportunity, this marriage, somebody is going bold. Somebody could be bold. Somebody is balding, but. This is a family that comes together. They pray together. They used to pray on motherfuckers together, too. It's this mother, the ringleader, who knows she was the, those generational curses was supposed to stop with her. She's about to stop some shit. Somebody actually really trying to infuse her with some more uh, toxicity. Um, it's, and when I say infuse her with some more toxicity, is it's the cycle. You hear me? Is what's mine is mine, what's yours is mine, and the like is what I'm hearing. Is what they were liking about whoever their loved one is about to marry. They don't feel like they need to pursue this relationship. And there's something that they want to express. Around the clock is what I'm hearing. Around the clock. Something about these happy days and what was discussed at this um, eatery is what I'm hearing. Or what was seen at this eatery. Mm-hmm. They don't know if they should vouch for this man or woman anymore. Because somebody is guilty. And they not only seen it with their naked eyes, but they seen it with their third eye. And somebody who is highly intuitive, who is very spiritually talented, that they are connected to, that they know about it. Yeah, um, somebody could already be married, is what I'm hearing. They could... They lied about getting a divorce. Somebody could be a bigot. About to commit bigotry is what I'm hearing. But somebody most definitely went back in time. They went back talking to people, you know, who know this person from back in the day. Um, family who have cut ties and the reasons why. And why this person is stuck. There's somebody else who's stuck and can't move forward. There's somebody else who's stuck and can't move forward. Mm-hmm. What's up with this food? I heard it through the grapevine. Somebody was hungry as hell for this information, too. July Leo, somebody was hungry as hell for this information. This information ain't had nothing to do with them, but they trying to... They trying to throw a monkey in somebody's game. They trying to disturb the peace, really. But it's this small talk that was heard. And what's most important right now was coming up out of a popular state of mind, not being confused about what's divinely taking place and what was hidden for so long. It's important that this person says this. And they say as soon as possible. It's important that they say this as soon as possible. But then it's something about this generational curse. Somebody got scratched up. Somebody got scratched up. 
It was some like cat fight. It's gonna be some cat. It's gonna be a cat fight. Yeah, it's gonna be a cat fight. Somebody is gonna be to the highest point of positivity because somebody got COVID. And what's most important is somebody's health. They said they walk in divine health, period. But is what's been taken for granted when it comes to this woman who may have a little pudge around her belly could be, you know, I'm, I'm hearing some, some stress weight gain. There's some jealousy that's taking place. But somebody wants to take the truth for granted and it's not going to happen. What's coming out of this person's mouth is totally disrespectful because they're talking about their weight gain or something. But somebody about to have your back, about your weight gain, your weight loss, you know what I'm saying? Or talking about why you don't lost weight or something, trying to throw you under the bus or trying to make like you you on drugs or out here filing a G sitting all that ain't true. It's stress related for real. It's somebody bald. Somebody balding, the quarry south node, Leo North Node. They know how powerful you are. They know how insightful you are. And they know why you didn't have it hard. And it's because of these generational curses. Could be this Leo too. It's something that's about to go on. And it's going to be in the evening hours. They're going to tell you about their daytime thoughts. Because it's going to be, it's going to lift a load up off you too. Somebody can be washing some whites too. Trying to get everything clean by the new year. So, somebody feels like this relationship is not compatible. Somebody about to find out something different. They are. They about to find out something different. 